Latin America, caravans of migrants are flocking to other countries, while Colombia has been receiving many from Venezuela. Mexico has been receiving many migrants from Honduras, Guatemala and El Salvador. Since they are unable to enter the United States, many remain in Mexico. The Catholic Church and other organizations have stepped up to help them. Father Ignacio Martinez is from the Diocese of Toluca, Mexico. Since December 2018, he's been working with the dicastery for laity, family and life in Rome. He says migrants would pass through his diocese along the way to the United States. The intention is for a better life, in favor of better conditions of life, in favor of families. We've always been a country that has migrated between the United States. Many resources that arrive in Mexico are thanks to the emigrants who support their families and receive these resources. One thing he noticed about the migrants was their unwavering hope to eventually reach the United States. It is their hope and they don't give up on their intention to reach the United States. The Mexican bishops mentioned in this recent statement about the Pope's donation to the caravans and humanitarian emergency in Mexico. They said some migrants cannot reach the United States. They stay in Mexico for a while, but they do not lose hope of one day arriving in the United States. Yet for those unable to reach the United States, Pope Francis recently sent $500,000 to help them in Mexico. The money will go to 27 projects in 16 Catholic dioceses in the country, funding housing, food and other needs. Father Ignacio says it's difficult for anyone to understand what these migrants have witnessed or been through. I imagine they try so hard and experience a lot of frustration. So having compassion in these shelters by people of faith, people with compassion who try to alleviate their frustration, their solitude, also finding places where they can work and rest, where they can feel human and feel like people, that someone cares for them. This is where the Catholic Church and Caritas Charities are stepping up to offer safe havens to all those suffering tragic conditions in their home country, holding on to the hope of a better tomorrow.